So to celebrate the release of the new Barbie movie, Mum had the brilliant idea of doing a M&S Barbie haul, aka pink haul. So stay tuned if you want to see what Mum has picked out for us to both try on. Becky here with my lovely mum Wendy Wu and uh, if you're new to this channel hello I do plus size fashion every Tuesday and Thursday um, so do subscribe down below shall we take these glasses off because we look a bit silly don't we we do I, I like our eyes to show because yes here we it's all part of our personality hey everything looks every, pink yeah. like, doesn't it <laughs> Yeah, these were, and we'll get into those in a minute. Yes. Uh, but yes, the Barbie movie has come out. Mum is the most excited of everyone <laughs> to about the, the the movie. She even got us these T-shirts from Boohoo because she's so excited. <laughs> we're uh, going to be wearing this. Yes. When we go to see it. Yes, so everyone's very excited about that. As you, you went with the theme pink. Well, yes. <laughs> <laughs> So everything you're going to see in this haul is pink and it's from M&S but uh, if you shop on M&S you know there's lots of different brands on there now so you've got some white company, mm -hmm. Phase 8, Phase eight and, and then these, mm. oh, yes. these are the sunglasses that mum picked up from Good Gooder, Gooder? Yes, but they're from M&S. Yes, yes but the brand is called Gooder. Yes, yes. Do you want to show everyone? What? Oh, okay. Giggly ghost, so you can see. Can you see the reflection? They're polarised. It's really weird. They're quite a green um, tint. Mm -hmm. And they are, like, you know, Rebecca says they're polarised. But when you take it off, everything is pink. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to think. Do you think it's a reflection? Well, green cancels redness. That's why. Oh, learn something every day, don't you? So... so yeah, they are okay. They're a bit of a... They're a bit of fun. Yeah. But I... I think have... they're quite an expensive piece of oh, fun. Oh, are though. they? They are. They're about £30. Mm. I don't think they're worth £30, really. No, and also, also I, apparently I should pay 60 because it says influencers should pay double, so... <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have paid double because we've yes, got two, two pairs. pairs. <laughs> <laughs> but quite a nice box. Quite a, you know, chunky sort of box, and it's got, um... Oh, nice that's little, cute, with little, little flamingos case, on. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, they're okay. I think if you were going on holiday and you just wanted to treat yourself and you were going along with the, the pink thing this summer, then why not? But yeah. I'm going to take them off now. <laughs> not um, so everything will be linked down below. They will be affiliate links, including these gooder glasses. And uh, <laughs> uh, don't forget to leave us a comment down below as to what your favourite piece were, and also let us know if you're looking forward to the movie, if you've seen the movie. And how many Barbie dolls did you have when you were young? I had a lot because my I used to buy them from boot sales, didn't we? Yeah, <laughs> I must have been one of the original children girls to buy a barbie it was yeah. in 1963 wow. haven't got it anymore Aww. never mind <laughs> um but yeah let's get into the whole video right so we've got here what was described as a mini dress on the website and you had a choice of whether or not you could buy the short version or the medium length so um or maybe it was regular i don't know but anyway i've just checked the label to see what the fabric is and it's actually got long length on it, but there's two lengths, okay? I couldn't wear it as a mini dress in, you know, the, the shorter length. And I certainly wouldn't wear it as a mini dress at the regular long length either. I, I don't know, I always think of things like the wind blowing and maybe showing my knickers oh, or just, something. But, it's really, really short. But anyway, I have paired it with some um, black uh, denim stretchy jeans from Next. And... Quite like it. It's uh, it's a nice fuchsia pink colour, and it's got a nice belt that you can cinch in as much as you want. Not elasticated. The fabric is actually I don't know fifty five percent linen, forty five percent viscose. 
So we'll crease a little bit. Um, bit of elastic on the sleeves. A couple of little pockets. What do you think of the back view, Becky? I like it. Nice. Yeah, the only thing is, like, if you were wearing it as a mini dress, mm. the last button's very high up. What like, no, down there. Oh. Look how high up it oh is. Gosh. So you could be showing your mini. <laughs> I'm speechless. I'm I don't mini. know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> the mini mini. Oh, well, anyway. The mini mini. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely oh. like a tunic. Yeah, no pockets. No pockets. We haven't got yeah. your booby pockets. <laughs> I don't know if I like... That's silly, I don't know. Why yeah. bother? Yeah. Um, oh, gosh, I can't remember how much it was. Oh, it'll be on the screen, don't worry. Yeah. okay. But I feel like you may have... I think I'd like to have seen you in a 22. Yeah, I think you might be right, because the shoulder seams have dropped quite a lot. Although you can't really see that, can you? Or can you? It just looks a little big. Yeah. I'm personally, I'm not into shirt designs. I used to be when I was younger, probably because I used to go to work with blouses with buttons down the front and so on. Um, I like things to be a little bit more loose, loose, a little bit more. Yeah, simple. I don't like stuff that's tight. Yeah. So, yeah, if if it's the sort of style that you go for, I think the colour is stunning, and like I said nice you can dress it up dress it down but very um, very mini all we'll squeeze in together yeah double trouble here yeah. we don't have to move back we'll move bit. back <laughs> <laughs> so this is from the white company you step forward mum you be the main event i'm going to be the main event oh, yeah sorry about so, that but yeah so this is, this is a a white company top. white company top um yeah it's a bit, it, it fits, it touches where it fits or fits where it touches, it's whatever, you know what it's I mean. Fitted. It's fitted. Oh, it touches Lord. where it fits. <laughs> oh, Lord. And to try and detract from the, uh, <laughs> the, the, uh, the fitting of it, I've, I've paired it with a, a little necklace just to give it a bit of contrast on here. I like the colour. I think that's just going to be the yes. whole theme. And I it's, like the colour. Yeah, and it's got some sort of... Um, like a braiding here, if you could see it okay. But it's got a, like uh, a linen y front, hasn't it? Like a, a stiff front, but then like a jersey woven back. Yes, it's, yeah, it's nice. I quite, quite like the I back. I like the back <laughs> material. The back material is really comfortable. It's a nice length. I think people will like the length. Yes. But I just think it's, it just needed to be just no, a tiny geez. bit less. Skimming over the tummy area. Pounds. It's quite a lot of money. Well, I wouldn't. Yeah. I wouldn't. It, no matter how much, I personally wouldn't keep it anyway. I think white stuff stuff is really good quality. Yeah. Like the fabrics are always really, really nice and wash really well and stuff. But I think it might be a bit mature for me. Yes. A bit mature. Yeah. This Whereas is for, for me, it's it makes me look younger, don't you think? This is for menopausal Barbie. <laughs> 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 so this top is from white stuff as well and it's the same material as the back of the pink top that we tried on together i really like the color i think it's very different it's like a a bubble gum or you were saying like a lilac pink mm -hmm. and yeah. i really like the pink and red contrast i think it's really really fun um again it's really really nice quality but the sizing is definitely like on the smaller side of a 24 um, so it is just like a little bit it's not cut for a plus size body it is sized up from a regular size yeah, and you can yeah, tell and yeah. um, so it's great that white stuff are doing bigger sizes but they are literally just sizing up mm, they're not thinking are they about the plus size the body garment we need extra room yeah, here yeah. and when you buy from like a plus size retailer like Evans or yours they always cut more space in the tummy and they're just not doing that here no. so it's a shame isn't it yeah it's really nice quality very very different like are these pineapples yes I think it's meant to be sort of like tropical fruit tropical isn't fruit. it and yeah. I really like that but it's just for how much this costs I, I don't I wouldn't wear it enough um just because of the fit yeah. being a bit 
Uh, and and also they they've put these little tiny cutaways at the the side, and I'm not sure what that's meant to do really. It's not doing enough. No, is it? it's not. No, it's an apology really. It almost looks like the seam has split, doesn't it? Oh no! <laughs> well, it hasn't. It no, hasn't. I know it hasn't. No. And then you have this kind of like a decorative seam down the back and then there's also like a weird seam edge to edge seam isn't it there edge to edge seam. well i think that's meant to sort of draw your eye down isn't it but you actually can't see it that much anyway but yeah it's nice quality and i think if you're like a smaller plus size then white stuff is, is a good option uh but yeah for me not i'm not, not today old. no well, we've taken a few minutes just to um, think about how I was actually going to get into this garment because there's no zip, um, just a big opening at the top. So um, I did try and get it on, first of all, with the belt tied up and then realised that was not helping at all. But yes, I got it on quite easily. It's got um, adjustable little straps here, like bra straps at the back. Um, obviously, I would wear a different type of bra with this. Because I don't want pants as well. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and nude pants as well. Because I've got the big, the big black ones yeah. on today, ladies. So uh, you can see those. Uh, there we go. Never mind. Um, but I do feel I like the colour. Yeah. I like the fact it's sassy. very flowy. The legs. You look very sassy in it, Mum. I feel very sass sassy. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. With You're very, jealous, very big legs. <laughs> I like to be on trend. What I don't oh, like. Oh, oh, here we go. And it's for me is I don't really like my arms showing. But then I guess. But that's 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 how these jumpsuits work, though. They have to be strappy. Yeah, I, I think what, what I'll I'll do when I get home is I'll have another look at it and um, just think about how I could oh, I know, deal with it or whatever, you know. Well, maybe. You could put like a t-shirt on underneath it. Yeah, that's right. Like you yeah. have it like almost like done. I could put my Barbie t-shirt underneath it. No, I don't think I so. I think either black or white would look yeah. nice. Yeah. Um, but I don't think your arms look bad anyway. Yeah. No. That's because I go to seated oh, zumba. <laughs> seated zumba. Right. Okay. Seated zumba. Right. So I I would give this nine out of ten to be honest. Yes. I what like about you. you I think you look, you look very sassy. Yeah. Okay. Then. Sassy Wendy. You sassy Wendy. Signing out. What's it made of? You have no what the idea. Fabric is like. I have no come idea. Come show us the fabric. You're not signing off yet. You've got more to do. <laughs> You've not come and shown us the fabric. Was oh. it like chiffony? Yeah. Is it? Oh, have a look. Uh, oh. Not what I thought. Almost like lininy. Almost. No, it's not linen. It's. Not lininy. But polyestery, but not polyester. Is it? Because it feels cool? really cool. Wow. I don't know. I'm sorry, folks. I'm not really prepared for this. Um, is there a label at the back? Or where no, would we find not, a label? The label's right next to your knickers, and I'm not going to. Oh. <laughs> no pockets, though. No, <laughs> no pockets. pockets. I think pockets would have looked nice. Yes, yeah, so they would have done, but then obviously that would put the price up, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's already probably expensive, yeah. so. Looks nice, though. Okay, so Bex and I have decided that we actually like this nice pink, fuchsia pink, shift dress. It's made of a mix of, uh, well, it's a linen mix, easy iron. So who doesn't like something that's easy iron? Mm. Must be, I don't like any ironing at all. So it'd be interesting to see when it's washed. If you can just, sometimes you just can hang it up straight away. Yeah, yeah. Or just put it in the, um, just hang it on the line. Yeah. And then refresh it. Sometimes in the you can hang dryer. it in the bathroom when you have a shower. Yeah. And it steams yeah. It. And that's right. And the steam sort of helps the yeah. creases to sort of drop out. But yeah, I really like this. Shame it's not got any pockets, but it's a very reasonable price. Twenty-seven fifty. Twenty-seven fifty for a nice. I sweet think that's hair. really good. It's a size twenty-four. Okay. Mm. So, but it's got got the give in there, and uh, it looks really nice. Yeah. Looks smart. And I've paired it with this little necklace that I've had for donkey's years. I, nice, I hardly ever throw jewellery away, you know, because well, there's, why not? there's always a time. Always a time and place. Time and a place and an outfit that comes along and you think, oh, I know exactly what I can put with that. So that's what I've paired it with today. Lovely. I really like this. Yeah. And it has a little keyhole neck in the back that I don't think you... Did you need to do it up to get it on your... No. No, I didn't. I was going to say, because no, your... I just popped it on. My head's not that big. 
<laughs> Short sleeve. Yeah. Very comfy. Do they do it in other colours, do you know? Maybe. Maybe black. must do. Must do black and white as well. Like I don't think they do white. I'm sure they don't do white. I think I black. think it was fuchsia pink and black, but I'm not sure. I might try them. <laughs> Everyone looks shit on me. Okay. So I'm Beach Barbie. <laughs> <laughs> Little Miss Raspberry this... Ripple, I think. Yes. Yeah, maybe we'll like Seaside Barbie then. <laughs> um, this is like, is it linen? A linen blend? Yeah, I think so. Like cottony. mid axi dress. It's cute, but it's just a little bit snug. I think up here, especially on my chest, it's pulling. And I also find it quite high-waisted for someone that's already quite high-waisted. Like my waist is here, which is high, but this is... It's a bit like an empire line, isn't it? Yeah. But it, it, does it feel restrictive there? Has it got any elastication under the bust? No. No. There's no, no. Um, the only stretch is in the sleeve, but the sleeve has got a double... That's what's weird. It's quite tight, it's isn't it, It's got a double poof. It's got a poof, but then a... There's a, so it's got a cap, hasn't it? It's got... Yeah. Da, da, da. Hang on a minute. Let's have a you look. see? Yeah. Which I don't think it, is... Yeah, it looks as if it's all quite constricted, really. It's not it tight? tight. No, but it looks tight. <laughs> Which it's, quite, it's quite sexy looking. Is it? Well, because you can see my bra because it's too short. And then this string was very short. Mm. So, and also, it's £40. Which... We were saying that a lot of M&S's beach dresses are now like in that area. And we just think that £40 for a beach dress is a lot. I don't think that was in the beach. Oh, is this not classed as a beach no, dress? No, I don't think it was. It's um, a summer dress. I'm just trying to think which section it was. Because um, I actually saw that hanging oh, in, no in pockets. one of the sections. I in. feel like this could have had pockets easily. Yeah. Um, And there's two, but it's not tight if I sat down in it. It's not, but it's it's actually my normally my smaller part is actually too big yeah. in the bust region. So it's quite feminine looking though. Yes, but again, it's definitely been sized up from a regular range, and mm, you can tell. But yeah. I like the colour. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm wearing this lovely tiered beach dress, and. Uh, well, Rebecca and I have just had a good laugh about it, really. Um, we've adjusted the sleeve, the sleeves, the ties, which are these sort of ropey, sort of jobby things here. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, it's quite a traditional style that you see, don't you, on beach, beaches and people sort of shove it over their bikini or their cosy or, or whatever. Um, I don't think I would spend 40 pounds on something like this just to put over my costume um, when I come out of the sea, just to cover up. I'd just sort of stick a towel around me or something. Oh, but just go, just go somewhere cheap. I just think £40 for that. It's just a lot of money, isn't it? It's so much it's money and it's not like there's special. any fastenings or... And, and I don't think it's very flattering either. No, that, like, that, that is in the complete, the worst place the worst on place. most, Look. not even plus size women. Most women have bigger, Bigger bum and hips that they're trying to cover up, and they are oh, emphasizing yeah. and there's it. There's no that elasticity drop. here at all. That, that's a drop waist in the worst possible. Oh dear, this is not really the best haul so far, is no, it? But, but Barbie so... is all about pink, pink, and you know, Barbie is. She needs to be decisive. She's she, and she's money smart. Definitely yeah. money smart. And that's what we are. And um, we're going to tell you the truth. So. Yes. And that's what Barbie does. <laughs> so, I, I must admit, I am a bit disappointed. When It's funny, isn't it? When you look online and you see the photographs... On the six-foot model. Yeah, or... The six-foot the six foot 25-year-old model on M&S website. Yeah. You just think, well, who, who are they trying to target? I know. And it's... They just don't quite Hit. get it right, do and they? And they also charge... Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Are we being too negative, guys? Sorry. Would you agree with us? We don't want to be negative Nancys, do we? We no. want to be positive Barbie Barbie girls, but there you go. Negative um, negative Nancys. Yeah. What do you think um, Ken would think of this? 
Not sexy enough. Not sexy <laughs> <laughs> Who had a Ken doll? I didn't like Ken when he was a Barbie doll. No, well, did you get her an action man instead? Did I what? Get her an action man instead. Because they had a lot bigger muscles, didn't they? <laughs> no, I just I just liked my Barbie doll and I loved the outfits that my mum bought me oh. and and when she couldn't afford to buy me anything Made. she used to make me yeah, little me. outfits and she did that for you, didn't Nan she? Made little yeah. outfits for one of my yeah. baby dolls. Oh. What, yeah. One experience I had was when I when I worked in um, in retail or in retail banking, I used to go and visit Ted Baker in their head office in London, and they had the most interesting mm. toilets there, staff toilets, obviously, and I'd been warned in advance that I had to go to the loo to see what it was like. <laughs> Uh, I didn't didn't actually go into the men's one, albeit one of um, the members of staff just allowed me to pop my head in and, <laughs> and have a look. <laughs> There's no one in there. But in the ladies' toilet, there were all these little Barbie girl dolls, all dressed up beautifully as part of the decoration within the ladies' toilet that and the cubicles. Cool. And then in the men's toilets, there was all these Barbie Boys. men... I'm well, you know Kens. what I mean, Kens, right, um, from over the years, all wearing different outfits and, and what have you. But, um, yeah, that was quite surreal, really. And, well, I've um, always been a Bratz. I like yeah, Bratz. you went on to Bratz, I didn't you, in the Bratz. end? Bratz, Betty Spaghetti and Polly Pocket. And yeah. I had a What's Her Face, which was very a weird doll. Is that where you put makeup have, on? Yeah, they didn't have a face. Oh, that was right. They didn't have a face, and then you stamped their face on. But when you got it, they were faceless. That's a bit spooky. Yeah. I think that was like bar. I think that was a bar, like a Mattel. They were trying to combat brats because brats took over. Yeah. Oh, I love because they were just way more stylish. Yeah, they were very edgy, weren't they? Yeah, and their makeup was oh, that so was nice. Warm, yeah. Where Barbie at the time was a bit. And they were expensive as yeah. well. Barbies were so expensive. Yeah. But you see, in my day, there was the sort of opposition from um, Cindy doll. Cindy and there was no way I wanted a Cindy doll because no Cindy way. was very old fashioned in comparison to the, um, the very, very trendy um, Barbie girl. But Barbie's still here and where the brats yeah, are. Yeah. Well, apparently. Oh, a bit of gossip. Um, the person that invented brats was working at Mattel oh, and right. he was still working there when he invented them so Mattel sued him wow. and that's how the brats disappeared wow, which I think is a that. shame it because is. I just that's feel like quite sad isn't yeah, it? yeah. Like, I love the brats so to take that away from us you know you've still got a lot of brats I know. Dolls, don't you, you don't know how many times I've wanted to ask you to bring me the Polly Pockets or whatever around because I want to play with them yeah well, you come around any time <laughs> You can go up in the loft and get them down for yourself. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, right. Wedding guest, Barbie. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it amazing how the same dress on different people mm, looks completely can, different. Yeah, can look completely different. Like, I think Rebecca looks fab in it. I think I just look awful. <laughs> Should I, I'll show me first. <laughs> okay, and then you go sit down. Yeah, then I can go and sit down. But anyway, I don't like this at all. It is just not my style. These weird sort of sleeve things here, a bit flopsy dopsy, and I don't know. It's just, it's not doing it for me at all. And I know I've got sort of flat shoes on, but even if I was wearing something with a heel, I just feel it's a bit frumpy for me. Not for me at all. And it is quite expensive as well, Bex, it's isn't phase it? It's phase eight. Not for me, folks, but Rebecca, what do you think? I do actually quite like it. Yeah, <laughs> I think you um, fill it out for a I start. I fill it then. out. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think it's quite flattering on me. I like the colour. I do like the frills. Because on you, the frills sag. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Probably need a better bra. Well, I think that, yeah. I think as well, I think if you're, yours oh, is oh, no. too big. I yeah. think you need to size down. I think this is the right size for me. So what size is so that? It's 26. Oh, There's right. lots of room in the skirt, but again, it's the chest. 
Actually, maybe I think there is a bit of. They're definitely wiggery. I wonder what your twenty four would look like on me. I don't, I don't know if it's the waist that would be too small. Like everywhere else, there's like a lot of room, mm. but that is the area. I don't know, but I like it. They're very pretty. Turn around. And there's like little, oh, like little tiny cutouts on the bridge on the seam which is very pretty oh you can tell it's a very good quality dress mm, it's been made, made nice but yeah it is very expensive i think it's 140 pounds mm. which like it is what it is at the end of the day like it's got it's a really good zip it doesn't get caught on the seam. It's lined. Mm. It's, yeah, it's, um, yeah. it's it's heavy, but it's not thick. It's a, it's amazing quality. Phase eight. I tell you what, if you've got an occasion, they go up to mm. a twenty six, mm. which is great. Mm. I don't that, think it's twenty six and everything. Oh, okay. But they do twenty sixes, and it's just nice. Yeah. I think you need a twenty two at least. It's too big, and like these frills on me come out. I think you need a different bra. Yes, because like, I'm sort of pulling this in now and it's giving me a bit of shape there, whereas when the, with this bit sticking out, it's looking very boxy. Not, not, I'm not going to... This could be a nice bridesmaid dress even, couldn't it? We could be Barbie's bridesmaids <laughs> when she marries Ken. <laughs> oh, <laughs> but yeah, I like it. So guys, that is the end of today's haul video. Let us know down below what you thought of everything. Are you a fan of pink? I hope so, because that's all we have for you today. <laughs> um, but yeah, do let us know uh, what your favourite was down below uh, and if you, what you thought of the Barbie film. I know here in the UK it's going to be coming out tomorrow, so I thought I'd try and get this video out just before mm, yeah. um so yeah let us know down below uh, also give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and big thumbs up for mummy wendy <laughs> <laughs> spent a lot of time picking all these yes, items out it was very hard <laughs> i just ticked the box that it said pink, pink. <laughs> oh my lord um and then also Give you, are we done thumbs up? Subscribe. We've, subscribe. Oh God, I'm getting. How many times do you say that? To, how many times do I tell people to subscribe? Too many times. Too many times. Some of you don't listen. <laughs> <laughs> but then there are some new people potentially yeah. looking. So, so you must time. subscribe. You must subscribe, and we'll see you very soon. Bye. Bye.